guys welcome to my youtube channel as you can tell at the title we'll be reacting to a video from truly and the title of the video my girlfriend act like a dog and i like it right love do not judge right so this is two couple that um, live together right and his girlfriend act like a dog so i will be reacting to this video and so enjoy the video and tell me your thoughts in the comment section below don't forget to give me a big thumbs up as well lorenzo he fell in love with jenna i think my favorite thing about jenna is her ability just to embrace who she is as a puppy puppy play is extremely important in my relationship that's where a lot of like my my love languages lie Despite living a puppy dream, this canine couple have had to deal with some harsh judgment. I definitely do get a lot of hate. This person is just... Okay, well, she walking on the ground like a, a dog. Yes, but um, she, don't, she don't look as if like she sleep outside or anything. So let me watch the video and see exactly. Absolutely mental, like out of their mind. When we're in public, they can be a little bit embarrassing at times. I met Jenna at a photo shoot last year. We sort of clicked almost right away on set. After they met, there was one thing that Jenna had to make sure Lorenzo was on board with. So I started first pretending that I was a puppy when I was really, really little. I would ask my mom to play with the dogs with me so I would just be one of the dogs and my parents always asked when I was gonna grow out of it <laughs> but um, I never did Jenna lives a puppy lifestyle and had to make sure Lorenzo would be the right owner for all her puppy okay well the, bo the both of them looking comfortable with this and she she wear a leech you could say that she wear a leech a leech Phoenix. as well when I first told him about this, he didn't shy away at all. He just was like, okay, cool. Like, so what do I need to do? So puppy play really was something that I've learned a lot of from Jenna. Some of her needs and feelings uh, are very similar, you know, to, to having a puppy, which I've never personally have, have had. But, uh, you know, it's something that I feel that I personally love embracing. Puppy play is extremely important in my relationship. That's where a lot of, like, my my love languages lie. Um, I It's very important to get a lot of praise, a lot of, you know, good job, you're doing great, you know, good girls. What oh, I like about so. being a dog is... Okay, so um, she barked like a dog as well. Yeah. The bond between, like, that one special person, like your owner, and yeah, like the day-to-day -day, like mannerisms of a dog that they have. You know, I like to be very carefree. I like not having, you know, a choice because it makes life so much easier. This is probably where I feel the safest at home. Um, it's kind of like my den. It's like my my area that I can retire to and know that I'm safe and, you know, no one can get me. The first time I saw, like... Okay, well, um, so that means you sleep inside um, the cage. Cage, I was... Um... I was sort of uh, shocked, I and mean, it was it was a lot bigger <laughs> than I thought. But once it was set up, and I saw just how happy she was and comfortable, she she really looks good and happy, and uh, I I think it makes her a great addition to the room. Showing their puppy love on social media has led to people questioning their roles in the relationship. Some of the most negative comments, it's probably just people saying that I'm crazy. <laughs> This person is just absolutely mental, like out of their mind. A lot of people have said like, 
you know, are you being held against your will? Is he forcing you to do this? Like, <laughs> blink twice if you're okay. I know myself that I'm not hurting anybody. I'm not in trouble. I, I'm just kind of living my life out on the internet. And with that comes a lot of judgment. I try to comfort her and let her know that there may be a minority of people that feel a certain negative way about okay, you, well. but you still have so to me guys it look as if when she when she out with with him um she crawl like a dog is that crawl yes like a dog so if she when she in public she act like a dog not only when she home that is what i'm seeing in the picture just now that they show up so i, I don't know right and we'll have me that I do care about you and love what you do we're gonna go to the park and I'm thinking we'll get some usual shots of you walking on a leash, take some video, some photos. Mm -hmm. But what if we throw a frisbee and you catch it? In my mouth? In your mouth, that's right. And if you catch it in your mouth, you know what you get, right? Do I get a treat? Yes. I get a treat? Yes. Yes. <laughs> Only if you catch it. Are you ready to go? Yes. All right. I'm ready. Let's go. Sit. Sit. She going to the park now guys like you see like she on her knees playing like a dog dog toy rolling all over on the floor so going to the dog park is obviously one of my favorite things when we're in public I can see how it can be a little bit embarrassing at times. There's weirder things out there, like a girl pretending to be a dog isn't really the weirdest thing. I think just for a lot of people, it's it's new to see it in the way that she does it. I don't find it weird. I would say Lorenz is the best owner that I could ever ask for. She cares for me. I feel like the luckiest puppet at the shelter. I want to give her that attention when she needs it, make her feel safe, and just overall see her happy and playful. Well, guys, that is the end of the video. Tell me your thoughts in the comment section below, guys. And give me a big thumbs up, subscribe, guys. And we'll leave the original link in the description box below, guys. So you would go ahead and watch the video for yourself if you want to. And see you in my next video. Goodbye, guys.